Hey everybody, welcome back to our crochet along. We are now going to do our decrease rows and then we're gonna close it up, or then we're gonna stuff it and then we're gonna close it up. We're on row 15 in the pattern. Um, I will put it in the description box below. Um, so let's get started. We are going to take out our stitch marker. Remember we had 36 stitches on this row. And now, we are going to decrease down to 30 to start. Okay, so we are going to one single crochet in the next four and then single crochet two together um, six times. Now, I have made a video, single crochet two together. Um, I will link that below. It's in the same video as the slip stitch. Um, so if you don't know how to do this stitch, um, or are not confident with that stitch, you can go watch that video. It's pretty easy and self-explanatory, um, once you realize what we're doing. I will try to show you here too, though. Okay, so here we go. Single crochet in the first four. So one, two, and now we're going to put our stitch marker back. Okay, three, four, and now we're going to single crochet two together. So to do that, in case you don't know and don't want to go watch that video, you're going to go into the next stitch, you're going to pull up a loop, then you're going to go into the, the following stitch, pull up a loop. So you've gone into two stitches, you have a loop on both, and then you're going to yarn over hook and pull through all three okay and now we're gonna do that um, set again so single crochet in the next four one two three four and single crochet two together All right, and then we're just going to go all the way around with that set. All right, now that that row, that decrease row is completed, we're going to do two rounds of one single crochet in each for a total of 30 stitches per row. <clears throat> Two, and we're going to replace that stitch marker. All right, so we have those two rows of single crochet um, for 30 stitches. And now we are on row number 18. We're gonna do one single, <laughs> you hear my baby, she's going crazy. We're gonna do one single crochet in the next three and then single crochet two together. And we're gonna do that six times for a total of 24 stitches. So here we go. One single crochet in the next three. One, I'm trying to stay in camera. Two, three, and we're gonna single crochet two together. One and two. And now I'm gonna put that stitch marker in. One, two, three, four. can't get it closed. All right, and now we're gonna do that five more times. 
one. Two. Three. Sorry, guys. And then two together. One. Okay. And again, that set. One. Two. I can hear my kids. They're all excited about something. Three. And then two together. And again, all right, now that we have finished that row, we are going to do two rows of single crochet in each stitch. So 24 stitches for two rows. So we're going to remove this marker. And we're going to do one single crochet in each stitch. So one, two, and replace that marker. Okay. Three, four, sorry hard to see where I'm at when I'm trying to pay attention to what I'm crocheting. <laughs> Hi. Alright, we're done with those two rows of 24. Now we are on to another decrease row, so we're going to remove this stitch marker. We're going to single crochet in the next two and then single crochet two together for a total of 18 stitches. All right, careful baby. My baby's messing with the camera. We'll see how this goes. Or she's messing with the tripod that the camera's on. Okay, so if it's wobbly, I apologize. Here we go. One, two, and then we're gonna single crochet two together okay and then we're gonna put that stitch marker back one two and three right here okay and then we're gonna do it again one Two and single crochet two together. One. Okay. And then one. Two and two together. Okay. Now that we have that decrease row done, we are going to do one row of single crochet in each for a total of 18 stitches. One, two, let's replace that marker. Three, four, five, six, whoops. Seven, 17 and 18. All right, one more decrease row. And this time we're going to single crochet in the next seven and single crochet together two, two times. So we're gonna remove the marker for a second. One. Two and replace that marker. And two. Okay. And then three, 
four, five, six. Oops, I caught something. Okay, and seven. And now we're gonna single crochet two together. One, okay. And then we're gonna do seven again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and we're gonna single crochet these last two together, which will leave us with 16 stitches in total. Okay, and now we're gonna single crochet one in each stitch, one row. So we're gonna remove that marker. One single crochet in each, 16 stitches. One, two, and oh, I didn't catch that one. Just kidding two and we're going to replace that stitch marker right there okay three four five six all right now that the body of the head is done we're going to stuff it with stuffing you can stuff it as um, soft or as firm as you want it. I am going to just go for like a medium firmness. Also, you want to pull this loop really, really, really long so that you don't accidentally undo your stitches because you don't want to, um, you don't want to fasten it off yet because you're going to come back to it. So you see my camera strap. Okay. All right, so because I ended up crocheting a little bit looser than I wanted, um, and I don't want a lot of holes, this is about how I'm going to keep mine. It's pretty squishy, but not too, too squishy. So now I'm going to work on the cap. So we're going to set this aside. Um, I have my yarn pulling out from the center. So what I'm going to do so that I have the same color, I'm going to take the yarn from the outside and I'm going to start on my cap. My baby's being all disruptive. All right, so to begin the cap, we're going to do um, a magic ring again, and we're going to single crochet five into the magic ring to begin. I know, you tell it, she is getting tired. All right, so one, two, three, four, and five. Okay, we're gonna pull that tight. Make sure it's all facing the same direction. All right, and now we're gonna single crochet two in each stitch let's see if we can zoom in a tiny tiny bit so you can see it better hopefully it doesn't lose focus this way all right two in each stitch for a total of 10 stitches okay One. i know yes Two, three, four, mm -hmm. <laughs> five, six, 
pen. And finally, to finish it off, we're going to do one single crochet and then two in the next. And we're gonna do that five times for a total of 15 stitches. Yes, I know. So, let's begin that. One. Two and three. Is that so? Yeah. Four. Five. Six. Fifteen, I know. And then we're gonna slip stitch into this very first stitch that we did on that row so that it looks nice and clean. All right, now that that is done, this is what it looks like. We are going to cut this yarn, maybe, there we go. We're gonna pull it through to finish it off. And then we're gonna tie this tail and this tail together. This just makes it easier so you don't have as many we weave, so many ends to weave in. The less we have to do with that, the better. I'm just gonna double knot that there and then I'm gonna trim it up a little bit. All right, and this is what it looks like on the underside and this is what it looks like on the top. All right. And then it's gonna go on the head just like that. All right, so now we're gonna join the cap with the head using the yarn that we already have attached to our head. So we're gonna pull this back to a normal size and we're gonna line up our chain stitches as best we can and we're gonna single crochet into each one to join the cap. It literally does not matter if your cap is pointing in or out. It's personal preference. So here we go. We are going to insert our hook into this one and then into this one up here on the cap. I don't know if you guys can see that. Okay, into both. We're gonna pull up a loop and single, if I can get it to go through, single crochet. Okay, and then we're gonna do the same next stitch. Okay, and then into this stitch, pull up a loop and single crochet. Whoops. And you wanna keep stretching three. All right, y'all, this is our head. And that concludes this video and we will finish it up in the next one.